Welcome back to Do Some Math. Today we're going to talk about this word. This word is subitize. Subitize means you can look at a picture and just snap. Say how many dots you see. You don't even have to count. But if you can't subitize them yet, which most of you won't be able to, but some of you I know can, then you can count them. But if you can just snap say it, then you can subitize. How many dots do you see? One. How many dots do you see? Three. How many dots do you see? Two. How many dots do you see? Three. How many dots do you see? Two. How many dots do you see? Three. Good job doing that subitizing. All right, let's do some patterns. Let's see what we have here. We have red car, green car, red car, green car, red car. <gasps> what comes next? Say it, green car. All right, let's try the next one. Pink butterfly, pink butterfly, blue rhombus. Pink butterfly, pink butterfly, <gasps> blue rhombus. And I bet a whole bunch of you said blue diamond. But you know what? Diamond is a preschool word. And in kindergarten, we call it a rhombus. Let's try the next one. Yellow square, purple triangle, purple triangle, yellow square, purple triangle. What do you think? <gasps> Purple triangle, you are right. Okay, try this one. Green circle, blue star. Green circle, blue star. Green circle, blue star is right. Good job. All right, today's math lesson is going to be about the circle. See the circle right here? A circle starts at the top and goes all the way around. A circle does not have any corners. A circle does not have any straight sides. It's just a curve around. And the circle is a flat shape. So let's go back to your binder and let's practice some circles. Helps if Mrs. Kessler gets the screen down for you. All right, let's practice some circles. You can use your highlighter because it's dotted lines, so we always get to trace with our highlighter. So we're going to start the circle. Circle starts at the top and curves around. Trace the next circle. Start at the top and curve around. Trace the next circle. Start at the top and curve around. You're not starting at the bottom, are you? Trace the next circle. Start at the top and curve around. The next circle. Start at the top and curve around. Let's do another one. Start at the top and curve around. And the last circle in our flower. Start at the top and curve around. Okay, we have a bigger circle here for our sun. Start at the top and curve around. Do you see any more circles that we get to trace? Oh yeah, I see them on our caterpillar. Here we go. Start at the top of the circle and curve around. Do the next one. Start at the top, curve around. Do the next one. Start at the top, curve around. Do the next one. Start at the top, curve around. Now, 
it wants to know how many circles, right down here at the bottom, it says how many circles are there. Let's count. One, touch when you count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve! Twelve circles? I don't know how to make a twelve! Oh my gosh! Does anybody know how to make a twelve? Oh yeah! Make a one and a two. That's a twelve. Good job, everybody. That's it for our math lesson. Make sure you do your math boom cards. And then I get to read a story. Bye-bye.